Going back, it seemed that walking on Mars was just a theory. However, it's now realistic. When the first pictures were sent back to the National Aeronautics and Space Administration by the Viking 1 spacecraft back on the 20th of July 1976, the realisation of Mars being a prime candidate to one day support early space colonies became a prime topic discussed in early design colonisation missions. Over the next few decades as more information regarding the Red Planet was gathered, it became even more apparent that our planet and Mars have a lot in common, including a similar rotational axis making the Martian day similar to the Earth day but only being roughly 37 minutes longer. Four distinct seasons and a rocky surface similarly seen across vast deserts and rocky mountainous regions on Earth. In recent years though, theorists have suggested that at one point in time advanced civilizations lived on Mars. The proof they have is alleged photographs showing animals and buildings. They say this photograph could prove that ancient humanoids lived on this planet. One theorist said that it looks like an ancient Egyptian tomb is embedded in the Martian soil. One theorist said the following, I think that in the past something happened on Mars. We have discovered so many things that look out of place, and although some of them can be explained, I think most of them can't. We can't be the only planet that has life on it. I think we're looking at proof of advanced civilizations and the reason they're not on Mars is because they moved on. Another anomaly that was supposedly discovered a few years back was that of the giant crab. This photograph began making the rounds on social media back in 2015, and it reminded many people of the facehuggers from the movie Alien. Some have said that you can make out eight legs. Many people have argued about its size, with guesses ranging from a few feet to the size of a car. So what are these objects that people are seeing? NASA have hit back and said they have the answer for what people are seeing. They describe how the brain has evolved to be able to find faces and other objects in crowds, and within the environment in general. This is known as pareidolia, and it's claimed that humans use this to enrich the imagination, and to see things that are simply not there. NASA have said that every anomaly that's seen on Mars can be explained as pareidolia. So what do you guys make of this? Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.